away they go. They're racing away from that 1160 meter marker. Zenzino Artista in the middle, that one got out well enough. Yard leader over towards the outside has got a bit of speed. Rain Victorious is racing there with a man on the catwalk in the green is up there too. And Chip Shot is a length or so from the leaders right now. And then came Fancy Some French who's racing in behind that lot. Geraldine is back along their inside. They few lengths off the leader. Checkerboard again is further back in the field. National Network is down towards the inside as well. They make their way now towards uh, the 500 meter marker man on the catwalk on the stand side chip shot is racing there with them and Futu is racing down the middle they being followed by fancy some french who's after those and Futu now as they come to the final 250 now leads the way over here from chip shot is after those but it's um Futu in a galloping mood as they come into the closing stages inside the final 150 now and um has got it one here coming away and pulling away to win it rather comfortably is um Futu going to win by three or four lengths. Chip shot second. Fancy some French was third. It got close for fourth. Maybe Metro Man finished just in front there of Man on the Catwalk and Prince Alberton. Well, welcome back to Turf and Team for the post race interview for the first leg of the Pick Six Race Four. With me, winning uh, jockey Sherman. Congratulations. Uh, he always showed pace and he kicked on nicely right, through, right down to the line. Yeah, thank you. He impressed me today. He jumped out and he was always traveling well. And going through the 400, I gave him one tap with the left and he, he pulled away from them and he just kept on going nicely. Yeah. Yeah, what type of field does he give you? I mean, Alec has tried him around the bend. Do you think he'll go around the bend? Do you, is he looking for a little bit further? Oh, it's, it's hard to say. It's the first time I've actually ridden him in a race. But, uh, you know, he, he came out and he won a very nice 11.60 today. I think he will go a little bit further, but um, that's up to Alec to decide. Yeah, he wasn't stopping at the end, that's for sure. I know you're always trying and uh, just one horse I want to touch on, Count Express. He surprised me last time out. Um, He's a hard knocker. I mean, what, what, how, do you, how do you think he'll go today? Well, he won a very good race last time and the time before that, you know, so he, he's had a little bit of a time off and uh, to, to, uh, the other day I worked him, he worked very well, so, you know, I think he's going to do a good account of himself. Congratulations and keep up the good work. Winning trainer, Alec Laird, congratulations. Second time I'm talking to you in a, in a week, so well done. No, thanks, yeah. Uh, anything that went wrong last time out? Uh, I know it was under the lights. Um, no, no, look, I mean, he, he, got into, he got squeezed badly on the fence last time. He, uh, he, he, we would have gone close to at least running second. And he had a shit draw last time. We um, took our chances running him in a 1400. You know, he's in the, in the um, ready to run race next week. And uh, I was hoping to win last time, and, and then we're definitely in. But um, so we took a, a chance from a bad draw. And, the two horses up front, they, they got it easy and we, uh, we tucked in and then we tried to make a run. But look, he, was, he ended up blowing quite hard last time and he's, he's a, you know, his name's Mfutu, but I've told the guys he should be Mafuta. He's a, he's a really strong bugger. I mean, uh, this, this, this run a week before, I think it's, it was a gallop for him. You know, he should, he should take it well and, and uh, you know, they pay 10 places next week and they're ready to run race. It's quite exciting to have a runner. I think he's in the race now. You know, he was already almost in. Um, on his previous form, but today that will seal it for him. Just touch on that race where you ran at Gravel. He was hanging out quite badly on that occasion. You know, uh, yeah, I, I don't know if, it have, if, if that what caused it, but he got a cut on his leg and it looks like it may have come from the, 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 the starting gates. And um, he, he also has green, we, that's why we fitted him with blinkers, because um, galloping him at home as well, he, he, he won both ways from the stick, left and right, and, and put the blinkers on him because he's, he's still learning. He's going to be a nice horse. And uh, the way he's going, he, he might have to be gelded, but when he wins like that, you can't geld him. I'm just really happy to have had a winner for, um, firstly, for, for Justin Lowe, but Jeff Van Leersia and Terry Kung, they, they got a new horse with me. So it's quite a, quite a thing. I think, don't think uh, Sherman's ever ridden a winner for me, not that he had many chances, but... It's nice to uh, get some new winners in, in the partnership. Well, Mr. Van Leer, it's the first time I'm meeting you. Congratulations on your win. Thank you. Thanks very much. Yeah, th thanks very much to Alec and his yard. They've done a good job here. Uh, we're a little bit unlucky last time out. Uh, I was quietly confident today. Uh, unfortunately, my two partners, Terry and Justin, I don't know what they're up to. I think they're probably sitting on the couch, but they left it up to me. Uh, and also, apart from my first uh, winner with Alec, uh, first one was Sherman Brown as well. So I think uh, the horse made Sherman look quite good there. <laughs> Absolutely, he ran on nicely right down to the line. And uh, tell me other horses uh, that you've got uh, partnerships in with? Uh, 
I've got Rocky and Rolling showroom. Uh, I've got a couple on my own, Fair Rosalind, who dead heated uh, 10 days ago, two weeks ago, in fact, uh, and Okeechobee, and that's about it at the moment, yeah. Well, congratulations on this one. Let's hope the season um, is positive for you going forward. Super, thanks very much. Thank you very much. Uh, gift from the RA ladies. Well, that was uh, the interview for race four, the first leg of the pick six, an impressive winner there by Mputu. Back in second, uh, you had the seven chip shots who did show their improvement, and uh, uh, back in third, number one, fancy some fridge.